And history is about to be made for women in the military, and a local World War II veteran has been invited to witness it. ABC 10 News reporter Leah Pizzetti introduces us to a woman who helped pave the way for this change. <laughs> The photos show women smiling at the camera back in the 1940s. These are ladies that that were inducted in Los Angeles. Women who stepped up to help during a time of war. Miss Gina Fishley was one of them. I saw the sign with the finger of Uncle Sam pointing, I need you, and I took it to heart. The World War II veteran has spunk now, and she did back then too. I did everything they told me to do. I went for it, I go for it, and they called me the gopher gal. Which is why she has a big trip planned. So here's your invitation. Request the honor of your presence that you are a guest at the United States Coast Guard Commandant's Change of Commands and Retirement Ceremony. Next week, Admiral Linda Fagan will become the first woman to lead the Coast Guard and any military branch. Unbelievable. And she's inviting other female firsts to join her for the Change of Command, people like Miss Gina. Do you think they'll sign it for me? They probably will. So I that I can prove that I really went there? I bet you they will. Okay, okay, we'll ask. Okay, sounds good. Okay. Miss Gina says when she first found out about the invitation, she couldn't believe it. That they had the wrong number. They, surely they could have had somebody else written down. But it's an honor she's looking forward to, ready to watch history be made. I'm proud to be an American first. Leah Pizzetti, ABC 10 News. Miss Gina deserves that honor. The official change of command ceremony will be next Wednesday, June 1st in Washington, D.C. And Miss Gina will be one of the many women there to watch that history be made.